Yeah, you want to talk about the Big Show show? Goon? Nah. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I guess we well, can. Tony, you can, so, you, you, can, you can kind of explain Tony, it to you, us. You, uh, you, you watch the whole thing, yeah. man. You watch. All right, the let whole me thing. make it as long and drawn out as Woo! possible. Tell hey. me about. Make sure to tell me about the grandmother. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, make sure There's no grandma in this, but. Oh shit! Did you guys ever go back and watch that movie, or did you not? Hell ever no. <laughs> what movie? <laughs> the main the event. The main event. No. Hell no! I didn't watch that. <laughs> Was that I homework? <laughs> <laughs> Bro. Yes, homework for next week is to watch Hell that Hell no. The only way I'm watching it is if it's a fucking Patreon thing. Yeah. <laughs> and you make me do it. <laughs> Five dollars. That's a good dollars. idea. No. Somebody. <laughs> All right. So, <laughs> so, so the big show show is yes. big show. He's dad and he's retired from WWE. And he's trying to adjust to life now that he's not in WWE. Also, by the way, he's got three daughters and a wife and that's the story. So big show. It's big. Did you know that guy? It's He's got, well, big. it's three daughters, but one of them, like, he has a new wife, right? Okay, and so, the other, yeah. The other yeah, wife she, is in, okay. like. So, yeah. he has two daughters, and then he has a daughter with another wife. Woman, yeah. So, then the. These the rats on the road. Big shows out her, <laughs> <big shows that laughs> her fucking. These rats on the road. <laughs> So the one daughter with his other wife, his ex-wife, comes to live with them, and then it's like, oh, this weird family dynamic, and Big yeah. Show's tall. The whole I thing only... is Big Show's tall for the first episode, if you didn't know. Ring oh, rat dude. goon. So... <laughs> Big Show plays a Paul I... White, so it's the White family. <laughs> <laughs> the White family, huh? <laughs> the white context. I-G-H, the they... White... Oh. <laughs> they showed WCW uh, grandma, grandma, we, by the way. We all we and they you see his grandma, hold on. We we watched so Pulse and I did watch the first show. Um first episode. And yeah. Uh and god damn did it suck ass. I tried, man. This shit I, is I first not off for me. I love the big show. Okay. I figured you would like this, honestly. Yeah. I'm, I'm I, like so I'm um, you not liking it makes I think me feel mostly better because, because I, didn't like I think it. mostly because I just wanted to watch I, I like this week, like I just watched so much wrestling. I was just like trying I'm trying sure. to catch up on my backlog and like I tuned yeah. into the show and like it's one it's one of those sitcoms where it's they go like uh the big show walks in the room, he says his line, the laugh track hits, daughter yeah. walks in the room, she says her line, the laugh track hits, wife well. walks in the room. Yeah, and, and the, literally <laughs> that and then it and then it goes whoosh. And she's at school, and she's like, "There's no hockey at the school, Dad." Ha 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 ha. You know, it's just like that. It's just like, dude, this is. Yeah. It's basically and also, just... one of the daughters is like holding a, a protest, and because she wants to keep a bedroom, but and then there's a bunch of kids there, and she said, "Oh, I uh, I got all this here because I tweeted on Dad's account." Like, no one was questioning why the big show's asking a bunch of kids to come to his house. <laughs> the the the, it's the delivery of it. I think. I don't think. Uh, it's such a weird so, show. It's, it's so definitely one of those. It, it's, it's probably a show for kids and not for us. Yeah, it's definitely not for me. I mean, like, you know, I mean, it's definitely <laughs> not targeted for me at all. Um, Tony, did you like it? Let me explain. Okay, so that dynamic is you have, like, the, the younger one who's kind of, like, the wacky. She does, like, all this crazy yeah. stuff. And then she's you got so, the. But she's smart. Yeah. And then you got the, the older one who's, like, the environmentalist or whatever. Like, she's running for school yeah. politics. And that, then you have, like, the outcast joining the family. And then you got Big Show who's, like, his whole thing through this whole series is that he's retired and he has no fucking idea what to do in his life now that he's not a <laughs> WWE wrestler. And it goes, the arc goes from the beginning to the last episode where the final episode is him like, I think I should go back to WWE. And then he's like, <laughs> fuck that. I actually like my family. WWE makes me be away from my family. So fuck WWE. I'm going to be a family man. And he stays at home. Well, fuck that. I'm going to go to <laughs> AEW. <laughs> But he fucking he does come back. <laughs> it's bullshit. So, he just no, came no, no, back no, no. recently. Again. So the story is that he's retired and that's it. But he uh he goes through like uh one of their career days and then they're like, What do you do now? And he's like, I don't know, I'm a dad. So he tries to be a real estate agent, but he's a big guy and he breaks like everything in his house. It's like Kevin Thorne. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't think the premise of the show is bad. I actually think it's quite good. Um, especially because, you know, Scott Hall did that thing one time at the Hall of Fame where he's like, uh or no, he did it in the rehab thing with with uh, DDP, where he was like, you know, what do you do when the lights, you know, when the when they ain't cheering for you no more, man? You remember yeah. that? So, like, I, I think the premise of it is good because it is true. I mean, when you dedicate your life to something, 
you don't know what to do when you stop doing it. I mean, it's, it goes yeah. like that for everything. So I it's mean, just very hokey acting, though. And it's definitely yeah, for it's yeah, it's like, definitely for people that are, that like uh, like Tony mentioned earlier, like uh, Fuller House or like something like yeah, that. Yeah, let me give you a rundown of like kind of how this works. So he's like Danny Tanner to the max kind of thing, and like the whole joke is that he's big. Like they make like a million jokes that he's tall. <laughs> It's it's not good. So episode one is that one that you guys are talking about with the on daughter comes one, to live. How come they, they just hang out on the roof and they got the Shawn Michaels gimmick that you can slide in on, <laughs> just get from roof to roof. That shit was crazy. They have like a roof patio thing up there. Yes, weird. It's what the weird. fuck? It's weird. And then the second one, he goes a career day and he doesn't know what to do. He doesn't have a job. Whatever. Idiot. The third one is five dollars, uh, ten dollars. Get a job. <laughs> <laughs> the third episode has less of the big show and more of like the family stuff, so that's kind of well, that boring. sounds like shit. The, I only want to see one, it for the big show. Does he wrestle? Uh yeah, there's no, he's a retired. Pl- <laughs> he re- he's retired. So let me let me Retirement start. is okay. the biggest work in wrestling, brother. <laughs> well, let me tell you. Okay, so he does this stuff. Uh there's a cooking segment where he goes on TV and cooks, so the big show cooks in episode four. And then episode five. Uh, sh- the wife gets fired, so they have to figure out what she's gonna do. Big cool. Show gives this big like thing, like, "Oh, you could run your own real estate agent." And he's like giving big life uh, advice to her. She should have become a wrestler. That would be a good episode. Yeah, why didn't they do yeah. that? Uh, they just don't. Or the know. kid wants number to become six. a wrestler. Yeah. Number six, Big Show goes to the Jericho's. No joke with Mark dead Henry, ass. Foley and Re- Wait, uh, really? Not not the Jericho, but it's a WWE cruise ship uh, where he invites he just his wife. To my go man's on whole the- shit. Listen, they invite his wife to go on the cruise ship, but now that the wife is... Rikishi fucks her. Is, no, 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 no. I wish. Foley but, starts going crazy. So, so he plans all this romantic stuff, but she's too busy working on the phone with the real estate thing. Oh, and bet. then Mark Henry, Mick Foley, and Rikishi Mark Henry wearing the salmon shirt, by the way. Uh, they all come in and have this like thing that Big Show planned for his wife, but they all do it with the wrestlers. So like they eat shrimp and get massages and a bunch of other stuff. Cool. And then uh, the seventh episode is a bunch of stupid stuff that doesn't even matter. Big Show does like some uh, <laughs> like wrestling thing, though. This is where he wrestles. So Big Show, they have like a ring in the school. And Big Show's like trying to, he's trying to help promote like his daughter's uh, thing that she's got going on. She's running for like class president. So he's in there. And everybody's like, oh, you should wrestle again, Big Show. And he's like, hell yeah, I'm coming back. And then the eighth episode, he's like, hell yeah, I don't want to wrestle anymore. WWE sucks. And so wait, he, did he wrestle on the seventh episode? Uh, he like if you can last like a minute with the Big Show in the ring, then you win. But he did anyone beat him? Uh, no. And so I then beat him. he stole Chris <laughs> so Masters' the, whole shit. Word the for episode, word. He's like, yeah, this sucks. <laughs> WWE sucks. I'm going to be a family man. I hate this. Wrestling is the worst. So out of ten, what do you give it? Uh, this is not for us and <laughs> anybody ever. <laughs> the uh, Fuck this it's literally show. it's literally what you guys were saying. Does where it it's get better? Like, no, it's like <laughs> it doesn't get better. Full... No. So the so the deal about like Fuller House has like that nostalgia thing where you remember Full House. Mm-hmm. This has none yeah. of that, and it's like the Big Show's not a good actor, and it's just not. Well, good. I felt like the delivery was off. Like when I watch Fuller, I've seen Fuller House at least a few episodes. Mm-hmm. And I've seen Full House, and I've seen I mean yeah. even other shows like this, like Fresh Prince, almost is kind of like that. Why do mm-hmm. those rule and this one? Doesn't yeah, and I think it's just the delivery. I, I don't. There's something about modern. Some of modern sitcoms that don't, I don't know, there's like a weird... The laugh track is too much. It is, like, there's it's too weird, much, man. like... Yeah. Yeah. Don't it's because it's not, it's not filmed in front of a live audience well, yeah. type thing where yeah. most of those were back in the day. Actually, you had like an audience yeah. there, so... Did like, Christina, did she watch it with you or no? Yeah, but she hated it the entire time. Okay, oh, well then I feel well, like that's... Yeah. Because she's definitely, that's her kind of like thing, I, right? I'll like, get my mom to watch it and report back. It's like a guilty pleasure thing, you know, but she just didn't like it at all. So yeah. it was, it was like, I don't know. It's like a binge watch show put on in the background and like, yeah, that was Dude, big show. I barely made it through the first show. I'm not even joking. Yeah, I tried, man. I really did. I was like, I wanted to like it. And like, uh, I know you did. Yeah, I really, <laughs> I, was, I really wanted to like it. I was I, expecting you to tell me, oh, I watched the whole thing. I was like, so uh, I didn't have to, but <laughs> I just not, went and watched more wrestling. Dude, that first episode took, it felt like forever. Yeah. Like, I, I think I got to the point where, yeah, I got to the point where she said at school she got pissed because Big Show lied to her about the hockey yeah. thing, 
And I said, Oh yeah. The, Cause she was, she wanted to be on the hockey team. There wasn't a girl's hockey team. So she was trying out for the boys hockey team. And then she was like, Oh, all the boys won't hit me. So big show was like, all right, hit me in front of them. And so she does. And uh, so now everyone's going to hit her. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> so big show just set that up for his daughter. Yeah. But uh, I guess I'd never mentioned this And episode five is kind of a weird episode. So like, uh, his daughter that from nice. his ex-wife comes in and oh. then uh, she's, she wants to see this guy named something turbo. I forgot what his name is. Something turbo. turbo and, and then oh, big show has like angry. a crush on this kid. And then he what? Has, like best Wait, friends. Hold with, on. What? Like, Please cause run that, so like run this that kid is like, this kid is he like a huge a wrestling what? fan. <laughs> Listen, watch the episode. He, uh, no, way. no, you're this supposed kid, to explain it. You this gotta... kid is like a big mark. He's like, oh, I love the Big Show. The Choke Slam's the greatest wrestling yeah. finisher of all time. And Big Show's like, hell yeah, this kid rules. He likes me. And then like they start <laughs> hanging out. And then uh, she's Uh-oh. like, this is weird. I'm gonna break up with him. And then she's like, also, what? Dad, the Big, big show? show, you have to break up with the kid too. He's like, oh, I don't want to. I like him. I think he's pretty cool. And then he had to go break up. Does with he him do he... one Choke Slam on this show? Uh, yeah, in the in the wrestling episode. Oh Ooh. shit! Right, Does he work a match with least... the kid or something? No, no, it's a, like it's, it's one, one of those. Minute. It's Chris Masters 30, gimmicks, you know. Like, get in the one, and... Oh, the one minute title. I like yeah. that. Five minute white boy challenge. <laughs> yeah, cool. <laughs> I might, <laughs> I might here, give here, it another chance. I don't know. Here's a here's Fuck a review no. that that is the best review I could. I want to like say. it, Johnny. No. no. <laughs> Go on. The review says their comedy pedigrees. LOL. They wrote pedigrees. Oh, yeah. thing. Their comedy pedigrees help make the show a tiny bit better than your average TGIF Nick Disney family sitcom. That doesn't mean it's a good show. But at least it's not terrible. I didn't think any of the jokes were funny. That was like the biggest thing for me. I didn't laugh. Yeah, Yeah, like I I I actually started getting upset. Like I started getting (laughs) fired up. (laughs) Like, what the fuck are you doing, Big Show? It was mostly the um, because I know Big Show can be funny. I've seen him be funny. All right, so here's the here's the big the big wrestling joke. So you got Mark Henry, Mick Foley, Rikishi, and Big Show in a room. Right, they're on the the Jericho cruise. And uh, he co- his wife comes in there talking, and then they have this shrimp, like a whole seafood thing. And then Big Show goes, you don't eat that. And Mick Foley's like, man, we're hungry, though. We want that shrimp. It looks pretty good. And then Big Show goes, okay, you can each have one shrimp. Guess what happens? They have a match. They don't have one no, shrimp. No, they eat one shrimp, but then Rikishi, no picks, like up a cr- <laughs> Rikishi picks up a crab leg and says... Then says he, he didn't say anything about the crab and then bites into the crab leg, full crab leg, where like the you know, with the shell and everything. And then Mick Foley goes, Why did you bite into the leg? And then there's a laugh track. What, huh? That's the joke. <laughs> How's that? The wait, where's the wrestling part of that? Ricky, no, no, that's the that's the main punchline, that's the delivery, and the that's how everything works. I'm so hating, I, think, I hate it even more now. What episode was that? that? <laughs> that's episode six, the big party. I think it would be cool check. if on episode six, instead, <laughs> Cat is Jack went back to Kawasaki, Japan, <laughs> and we had ourselves Kawasaki a king dream. of the death match <laughs> <laughs> for the crab leg. <laughs> Dude, I would rather see Big Show on a show where he's an Italian chef and he make it a gabagoo. <laughs> <laughs> hey, motherfucker. Hey. There's a cooking, hey, a there's a cooking episode. Dude. There's a cooking episode where he makes oh, gabagoo. Shit, does, he, does he make gabagoo? He makes gabagoo? Yeah. He makes a hot dog casserole. You lying oh, bitch. Shit. I thought it was I didn't <laughs> I'm not sure what gabagool is. So fired up. <laughs> it's Italian delicacy. Italian Italiano, the motherfucker. Fuck, Spaghetti <laughs> sandwiches. Mother bitch. So we're yeah. biting into a crab leg and Mick Foy saying, I didn't why did you bite into the crab leg? And then Does anyone die right. on the show? No, unfortunately. They weren't in Kawasaki. See, this is what I'm saying. I'm sick of the bullshit. When is Cat is Jack coming back? Damn it. <laughs> How'd they not do one episode where, like, the, they do an episode where the wife loses her job and her idea isn't, oh, maybe I'll try what you did? Yeah, that like, would have been fantastic. That's, writes itself, bro. The, and, and the big show is he can still work. He just worked the other night. So, like, just <laughs> work a match. Yeah. What the hell's wrong yeah. with you? Dude. No, he was trying. You miss. You watch the product, dude. You don't get the story. No, I refuse. I refuse. The story arc is that he's a family man retired from wrestling, and he gets an itch to come back, but then says, "You know what? Family's more important than wrestling." So he no, 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 no. He says, "Family's more important than wrestling." It wasn't. It's not. He came back to try to win the WWE title. Yeah, he was just here. This is not canon to WWE. His name is the Big Show. This is a sitcom. I don't understand. This takes place within the lines of the sitcom. It's It's not canon to the... I think it's canon. Yeah, I don't understand, first off, They show clips of him in the WWE. Yeah, and in WCW. 
So yeah. I'm trying to figure out. Long hair, lesbian. Big There's show. a joke where he had, where cigar, he right? gives it, where he gives that Turbo Kid a WCW. It's a picture of Big Big Show with uh, as the giant with long hair, and it says Big Show on it, and Turbo wears the shirt. It's great. You should watch they, this. They show. Wait, the cool. But he wasn't the Big Show in WCW. But it's canon for the show. Okay, you just want to keep messing with history, Vince. Is that what you want to keep doing, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> Listen, James. <laughs> this wasn't. I'm just saying, if Big Show worked a match. Dude, listen, listen, dude. <laughs> if Big Show worked listen, a match, it would be a lot cooler. Correct. And James, listen. I'm, Big Show I, I'm listening. probably doesn't have a daughter who, with an ex-wife and two other daughters and a wife who does real estate. I'm sure that's all canon too, well, his right? His name's also not well, the Big Show in real life. <laughs> his name's Paul White in the show, Selby, by the way. Selby his name's Paul White in WWE too. His debuted. real name's Paul White, dude. His real name he is Big Show. WWE is Paul White. It's you guys canon. suck, dude. This show That's is fun. just a show. The show sucks. But I don't know hear me out. On episode six, <laughs> if Cat is Jack got out the barbed wire board. No, this is like, this is Mick Foley comedy circuit. It's not Cactus Jack. Sorry. What if Rikishi put his ass on him? Tony. No, Rikishi. Rikishi's Mick a crab Foley leg, is Cactus Jack. Crab leg. No. Not James. in this story. Not in this canon. Mick it's not Foley canon, is, I guess. But it's, but it's canon to WWE, and he definitely was Katniss Jack in WWE. This isn't canon. These. So this, is WWE canon, Big Show Show canon, and Big Show Show canon isn't WWE Okay, canon. well, hear me out on this. <laughs> if, Kat is, if this was not a possibility, hmm. then was Big Show the only wrestler in the WWE that existed? <laughs> Because I feel like Mick Foley could have came out in the wanted dead or alive and definitely could have worked no, the match. Bro. Big Show retired. That's the story they're telling no, on this. That's, a, that's the story they're telling. You're lying on this. to the listeners. Yeah, Shawn Mark Michaels Henry retired. Sandwich. Terry Funk retired. All right. <laughs> they all came back. They all come crawling back. And that's what I'm saying. If they would have made an episode where it got real dark where Big Show's like, man, I just don't know what the fuck to do without this wrestling shit. And then, he like. Did. I was just saying that you. But he then, yeah, but then he, he starts wrestle. wrestling, and then it he turns did. into the movie with the he, wrestler. Oh no, he's not gonna splash off the top and die. No, what kind of why show the are fuck that? not? This is this show because is not getting. Have a season. This is not getting want, season two. They they want, want season two. <laughs> this is not getting James, renewed. James, they already have gave the seen, finish. <laughs> have you seen all this shit on Netflix? There's gonna get a season two. No way. Well, what if he got brought back to life? You did? Did you see? You know what I mean? You ever see? All right, so I posted a gif earlier where Dino got brought back to life by resuscitating his. Yes, cock. they rubbed his dick. Yes, yeah, now it. we're talking. You want to aim the show towards all the right, deadlock boys? Okay, here, deadlock goon. Listen, listen, listen. Okay, <laughs> episode nine. Sorry, I forgot this one. Uh, Big Wait, show. Nine? The oh. secret gets episode. Gets back into the ring. He gets yeah. back into the ring. This is on Hulu, by the way. Fights Hulu. Drew McIntyre. He gets back in the ring, fights Drew McIntyre, does a splash off the top, his heart explodes, they resuscitate his dick, and then he's oh back, my God. baby. And he he's wins back. the undisputed. The big show's how'd back. Leave, how'd you leave this episode out? It was on because Hulu. it was on Hulu Plus. This and is I don't absolutely know if you, canon. And yeah, and I then, think so. Um, and then he wins, but then get this, Vince McMahon beats him for the title and has it for like a year and then goes over the rest of the top guys. Oh. Well. And it's called the Mr. McMahon sorry. Show Show. Sorry to hear that. <laughs> I mean, like, he, I mean, okay. I, I feel like we need, I need Tony to review more wrestling TV shows every week. Yeah. Because I love him explaining them, and I love him getting angry <laughs> at me. <laughs> because you guys are dumb. It's, it's, <laughs> the show is a box. Everything that happens in the show is inside of this box. It, okay? It just. Well, I'm 100% serious. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't know that. <laughs> Have a good day. Not the wrestler, okay? They're not going to make the big show but, as the wrestler. But like, if right? I'm writing this box, I would yes. definitely write in an episode where someone fucking bleeds. And if you have Katniss True. Jack on the boat, which, by the way, they stole Jericho's whole shit bar for bar, word for word, then I would definitely have them fighting on the boat. Someone's going overboard off the boat. You know, you can have fun with the show, and I think that would have been funny. The audience would have maybe laughed, but no. Instead, a big show going overboard. I would have died laughing. Yeah, I would have been like, "Whoa!" And he makes like a big splash because he's a big but guy. But then, to be fair, I also am not going to make it to that episode because I'm no longer watching the show. Me neither. But someone would, and they would have laughed. Not me, but somebody. Tony, did you laugh at all during the show? 
I laughed at how stupid it was. Like, this is dumb. Not like genuine, like, I think you liked it. You're defending When the crab leg was bitten into by Rikishi, I died. Good. That's comedy right there. That's comedy. Crab goon. So, so what did you give out of 10 again? Don't watch this out of 10. Damn. Solid eight. I like it. I appreciate that. 